Hey guys. Hi guys. Hello. Hola. Buenas, 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 buenas. Okay. So today I'm here back with another video. And this is a haul video. And not just any kind of haul video. It's a vintage haul video. I was in Barcelona for a few weeks. And of course, when I was there, I went to a few vintage shops, thrift stores, whatnot. Um, and I got some stuff. As you can see, a pile of stuff right here. So the first store I went to was this store called Le Swing. Um, all these stuff I've already washed and took care of, but I put them back in the the shopping bags because so that I can, you know, it's a lot more easier to show and organize and stuff. So yeah, I got this little purse here, this vintage purse. It's like those um, Enid Collins knockoff that they made back in the day. So it's the wooden um, base and these are not real leather, but I think, hold on. Yeah, they're PVC, but they're, you know, pretty much well made. There's a few gems that um, are missing and stuff, but it's still really cute. I still rocked it. I feel like it has a lot of character and, you know, it's really good. And actually, it suits any type of... Um, girly floral um spring summer type of outfit actually i don't have the the shopping bag from this store but i i have the tag um it's called olala vintage olala vintage um it says the first thing i got was this sweater and this was um dead stock uh, still got the tag here um, But I obviously I had to take it off because I, I washed it So it's a nice jumper sweater pullover type top Very nice really cute You know, you know, then the other item I got was this skirt. It's kind of like this Western Type skirt. I, I thought it was really cute pink with tiny ditzy floral prints thought it was really cute you know I I went to this random thrift store I don't know what it's called I don't remember what the shop was called I I'm sorry I don't remember anything about it but I got this wooden bangle it's green pistachio color wooden bangle and this orange marble uh, acrylic bangle it's really cute it actually matches my outfit right now maybe I should stack it on huh yeah it's nice okay next thing I went to lullaby vintage this store was really cute because the owners, um, really nice couple. They helped me out with a lot of stuff, and I I want to big up Andrea, Andrea, um, a friend that I met in Barcelona. She showed me a few vintage stores, and I I'm I'm so grateful for that because if not for her, I wouldn't be able to visit this store. So from this store, I went and got this nep skirt it's really really cute skirt washed and wore it while i was there love the skirt is this oriental cocktail dress really cute i have to steam it but so cute you know why because the back is open like that and when i wear it it's like it snugs like it just 
it fits very well on my body it's such a nice pearl gray color the print amazing oriental i am i am in love with this dress i don't know when i'm gonna be able to wear it but i'm gonna find it i'm gonna find that day okay i'm gonna find that occasion then the next item is this dress really cute dress here i believe it's early 60s kind of reminds me of pucci um really nice rayon such a cute print and i love the little ruffle at the neck super cute then i got this 60s mini purse i believe it's like a lucite um plastic thing here at the top we open and the straps are actually you can take it off if you want then i got some little tiny pieces here i got another bangle plastic bangle with carvings i got this pin for my hair a barrette and I got another hair pin, and it's a hand. So cute. Okay, um, this is my last store. I think I I got the most um, from the store. It's called Trash Closet. They actually had a lot of 50s and 60s stuff, but you have to dig, like you have to go through everything to find what you want. And that's what I did. First thing that I got is this 60s dress. Hold on. It's red. 60s dress. The neck part goes up like that. And bottom is box pleats and it has the belt. I know it looks weird because I'm not w actually wearing it, but the belt comes up like that. And in the back, I mean, you could wear it in the front, but I like the accent in the back. Like there's buttons there. So imagine if I wore like a, a cream color um, knit top or something under. You know, it would look so cute. Or like a, a white blouse, long sleeve white blouse. It would look so cute and mod. This skirt. It's a 60s skirt, I believe. The skirt looks like this. And what I like about it is that it has pockets in the front. It's so cute. And I love the pattern, the check pattern. And the shape, very cute. You can um, dress it up as a 40s style or 60s. I love, love this, this skirt. Another skirt I got was this 50s circle skirt. So cute. I love the print. It's like this sunburst type print and it's red i love red i actually have to find some vintage buttons um because it has these little tabs in the front and in the back you see and i think it's supposed to it's like a belt loop or something i don't know but um it looks like it had some buttons but it was removed and there is a button here and it's kind of looks like this army green olive color but i feel like clear glass buttons will look really nice on it so i might have to find some this is another dress i got this 50s dress here you know a 
a simple summer summery dress as you can see you can see it through it's very lightweight and great for summer i love the color very pastel then i got some scarves this green one this one has a lot of flowers paisley print very pretty very very pretty and the last scarf is this really nice silk chiffon so cute this i love this blue color yep then i was actually very cold so what i did was i got a jacket coat jacket slash coat um and again i love nep so i got this um jacket another nep jacket and this is i believe it's maybe some 80s or early 90s piece because as you can see the tag but i think it's an 80s does 40s style because of the sleeve got this little puff at, at the top here and as you can see the shape of the sleeve and the fact that it has this one button here only one button and then it has like clasps that you can you know put there two clasps it's, it's a very 40s or even 50s style jacket i i just i fell in love with it so i was like you know what let me get it and it was really cheap so very nice and then the last item is this cocktail dress i was so so happy when i found this and it was for eight euros so that's like ten dollars ten dollar us right it's this late 50s early 60s cocktail dress look at the shape so cute so poofy at the bottom like when I wore this I automatically thought I look like a cake because come on and of course I have to repair the straps because it's kind of like torn and it's like somebody just you know tied it because it was falling apart but other than that, everything else is really nice condition. The zip was very um, good. All the hooks and everything. Even the inside, there's no holes or anything. Everything was intact. You know, the... the yeah, it's just so beautiful. I, I, I was so surprised when I found this. I was like, yes. So cute. Imagine with a lot of diamante um jewelry oh my gosh oh my gosh i was so happy that i found this so yeah so now you know you just gotta dig and i dig and i dug you dig you dig you dig okay so yeah, that's pretty much what I got, all the vintage secondhand stuff that I got from this trip. If you have any questions, please let me know. I'm so happy that I got all these things um, and I'm, I'm so excited to actually wear them and probably show you in some other video or take some pictures. You can check them on my Instagram whatnot. So yeah, thank you so much for watching. I hope I can do more vintage related videos. If you have any questions, any requests, you know, any ideas, please, 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 please let me know. And I'll see you next time.